What is up, Baltimore Ravens fans? It is IndyCar Tim once again here for your halftime uh, quick hits, I guess, against the Arizona Cardinals. 14-7, to your Ravens lead. And I'm telling you, though, don't feel too terribly good about any of this right now. Um, you know, and it's funny. I was trying to think of a way to describe the way they're playing. Um, they're not playing poorly. They're not, they're not playing, you know, I don't know. Like I said, I've been trying to think of a word to describe. They're not playing mediocre. They're not, uh, you know, giving anything away. The Cardinals are bad. If you saw my little pregame quick hits, we talked about some of the stats of how bad they truly are. Uh, the Ravens just it doesn't look like they're clicking. Again, they're not playing poorly necessarily, but they don't look anything like the lot the game the uh, team we saw against the Lions last week. And but nobody expects to see that every week, and that's okay. Um, but when you look at the stats, if you're not watching the game and you just look at the stats, you're like, well, this doesn't look bad, Tim. Uh, Lamar Jackson, 12 of 18 for 116 yards, one touchdown. Uh, the running game is terrible right now, though. I will tell you that. the uh, Gus Edwards, six carries, 20 yards. He does have the one touchdown. Justice Hill, two carries, 29 yards. Uh, does not look great. Uh, we looked at a little bit of it um, here during the game as I was trying to update some of the uh, stats and stuff. The Ravens, just 139 total yards. That doesn't look great. You've had just five drives. Um, your third down's just three of six, but you've held the Cardinals to one of four. Again, the Cardinals are terrible. We know that. You've also held the Cardinals to two uh, turnovers on downs. Not sure what they're doing there. It wasn't, you know, the game's been tied most of the first half. Uh, they weren't up against anything. It's This is just a bad bad coach team, I'm telling you that right now. The, uh, the Cardinals are, um, at least in my opinion. The Ravens gaining five yards per play. 111 total passing yards to just 55 for the Cardinals. Uh, your rushing yards total, and this is where it looks terrible, 28 total rushing yards for the Ravens compared to 78 for the Cardinals. The Cardinals aren't supposed to have a good rushing defense. They've got a decent pass rush. Uh, if you look at it, most of the rush is going through the middle, and that's where you want to really want to do that. You've had Lamar run a few times to the outside. I like how they're using the dump-off play, some some screen plays uh, to get the ball to the outside. the same thing as a run play, really, uh, when you set up the screen properly. Um, but, uh, so you know, some of those passing yards were te technically run plays, kind of, because it's a screen to the flat, and then you just set up the uh, blockers for the running back or whoever caught the ball. Um, but, you know, I, I sit here and I hate to say they look bad because they don't look bad. But they don't look great either. Do I think they're going to win? Yes, they're going to, of course, this may end up being a 31 to, you know, 14 game, and it's going to look like a blowout at the at the end of the game by the Ravens. But this first half was a struggle. You didn't get the extra, you didn't get the that second touchdown until the interception there with, uh, what, with less than two minutes left by Brandon Stevens on, by the way, a terrible, terrible throw. By Josh Dobbs. I like Josh Dobbs, man. I think he's got a little something in the right system. He's got a little something in this system, and it's probably not even the right one for him. But that was a horrendous throw. It was five to ten yards over the receiver's head and didn't look close. Brandon Stevens was right there waiting on it. You know, good for good for good for the Ravens. And ended up ended up setting up that touchdown there for him. And they needed that. They needed that shot in the arm. Um for sure. So, you know. Moving forward into the second half, I'd like to see a little more rhythm by the offense. I'd like I would like to see them run the ball a little better. You've got a lead now. Go ahead and get you another touchdown, a little insurance touchdown, and just start running some clock. And this team would be really good at that if they could uh in this game, if they could get uh if they could just get the ground game going. And they may very well be able to do that. They'll make some adjustments here, Monk and Will at the at the half, and we'll just see. What they can do with this seven-point lead against, again, a really bad Cardinals team. With their only win, beating the Cowboys. Take that for what it's worth. If you think the Cowboys suck, you're probably right. If you think the Cowboys are good, you're probably right. Who knows what the Cowboys, look at what they did today, 43-20 to 20, uh, against the Rams. God, they just, defense looks amazing, but that's the Cardinals' only win to the Cowboys. Go figure. All right, boys and girls, we will do it all again in the uh, at the post game after the Ravens 
finish off the Cardinals, hopefully. And we'll talk to you then. Until then, boys and girls, we'll see you.